I'm Doug Coyle, I'm uh, with DJ Coyle Rugby. I'm here with Dylan Fawcett, uh, U.S. national team hooker, and uh, you've been a, a captain uh, for Rugby New York for a while. You're a certainly a leader. Uh, you are entering a milestone match the next time you set foot on the field, probably next week against Noah Gold. Uh, it's your 50th NOR match. Uh, only two gold players have achieved that so far. Uh, what are some of your best memories of playing in the MLR? Cheers for having me, Doug. It's great, to, it's great to have you here and after getting like a big win against San Diego. Uh, the emotions are high. It's really important that we got that win. So, uh, yeah, so excuse me here now. Um, I've been a part of two great teams, you know. I was really fortunate to get that opportunity with, with uh, the Glendale Raptors for my first year in the MLR. And uh, then really, uh, my great memories now truly are with New York. You know, just being a part of this team for for so long and being able to be uh, around such great men and this great organization. You know, I'm, I'm truly it's something I'll always be able to hang my head on. I'll be able to look back on 20 years down the line, bringing my young fella down here, or you know anybody, and I'll be able to say I helped build this. So um, something, something I'm really truly proud of. You've been a, a leader on the field and off the field. Uh, you lead by examples. Some people say you have a fiery style uh, with you. When you, down the road, whenever it might be, you hang up your boots, what do you want to be remembered for? The thing I'd want to be remembered for the most, Doug, is uh, to be the ultimate team, team member, you know? Uh, that no matter what, teammates could rely on me. Uh, I always brought great energy and you know, I did everything I could for the team at all times to succeed. You know, uh, I've fallen short a few times now in this league and I truly believe this year is we're on the right track to getting there, you know, and going one further and getting the job done. So. Uh, I certainly hope uh, we can talk to you again after another 50 matches. Yeah, that will be pretty special. Uh, yeah. you, you've also uh, uh, helped the youth in the area uh, not only here, but in uh, Georgia. You've been a coach uh, for a number of teams. Uh, what are some of the uh, goals that you might have, either personal or rugby goals, and or challenges that you might want to meet? Uh, one of the most special things about this game, Doug, is the, the, the connections and the, the, the people that you meet. You know, so I, I, I do believe, no matter what it is down the line, that I'll be an asset to whoever I do, wherever I go. So, uh, just because of the things that I've learned throughout this game and, and just uh, coming up, growing up with those values. So it, I don't know what's what's in store, but all I know is that I'm, I'm living every moment to enjoy it and to be the best that I can be, to, to leave the jersey in a better place. And I really want to go that next step further to become the best ma best player, the best teammate I can be. So whatever is down the line for me, uh, I just keep enjoying my game right now. And I'm, I'm really, truly, Lucky to have this experience. Uh, th thanks for sharing uh, with me today. I wish you and the team the best this season. It seems like a special group of guys. Cheers, Doug. Keep enjoying it. Thanks very much. Thanks.